everybody, Erica Serwin here from Pink Buckery Designs. I've got a pretty simple card for you today. It features the brighter, the Bright Skies bundle from our 2024 Spring Mini Catalog, as well as the Sunny Days Designer Series paper. These two products coordinate. Um, we're not going to use it for this project, but as you can see, the dies from this die set not only do they cut out the stamped images but they will cut out these clouds as well that's in this paper i love when stampin up does that i feel like you get more bang for your buck um, when you have paper that coordinates with your dies now the paper is a free choice during celebration 2024 um, you can get this paper for free with a 50 dollars purchase um, only through the end of february so make sure if you want it you snag it there's some, um, of course, the clouds and rain images, and this is the paper we're gonna use on our card today. But there's also some really fun images um, as well. The strawberries, butterflies, there's some beautiful flowers. I love the sun. Um, we've got cherries and then kind of a rain print as well. So uh, 12 pieces, 12 pages, is that what I'm trying to say? 12 sheets, that's what I'm trying to say. 12 sheets in the package, um, two each of uh, six double-sided designs, 12 by 12, free with a $50 purchase. Okay, well, let's get started making our card. This is actually a card I made for a swap um, back before the catalog went live, and I loved it. I can't, I couldn't wait to show it to you. I'm actually gonna use two different sentiments here. Um, for my card base, I'm gonna stamp a pattern on the back. And I know you're gonna think it has to be perfect, but it does not, because look, really, not very much of it shows. Um, for the background, I'm gonna use Brighter Skies or On Their Way. So I'm gonna take my Pool Party um, ink and my Pool Party card base, and I'm just gonna start like this. And I'm gonna go kind of edge to edge diagonally. I'm not gonna worry too much about the middle because it will be covered up with our designer series paper. And I don't want the uh, words to be exactly the same every time, so I'm kind of shifting them. Let's do like this. Oh, let's bring it in like that. Um, you can see mine is not perfect in the least. It's kind of crooked. It won't matter. It's still gonna be very cute. All right, so go all the way around your edge. I know some of you are like, oh, cringy, but I promise you, let me show you. Doesn't need to be perfect because when we take this paper and we set it right on top, can you tell it's not perfect? No, you cannot. So don't worry, just slap that ink on there and go for it. All right, so I'm gonna get four dimensionals and we're gonna put this piece, this is the rainbow piece. Now the measurements and supply list will be over on my blog, so make sure you jump over there and grab it. There's also two other Bright Skies projects for you. Okay, so now we've got that. Let's do our stamping and our die cutting. We're gonna need a yellow sun and a white cloud. Um, we're also gonna need some raindrops. Look at this beautiful paper. The colors in here, or let's see if I can remember, Pool Party, Lost Lagoon, and um, Pretty Peacock. So I remembered we had this beautiful Pretty Peacock design uh, shimmer paper, and I thought, wouldn't that make fun little raindrops? So that's what I used. All right, so we're gonna stamp just a Daffodil Delight Sun right there on that side. And I'm gonna use the Pretty Peacock ink this time, and on our skinny strip of basic white, I'm gonna stamp Sprinkled With Love over on the right side, like that. All right, let's do some die cutting. Let me bring over my cut and emboss machine. I've got new plates, aren't they pretty? I love new plates for my cut and emboss machine. Okay, so we're gonna get this. Now I wanna tell you the sun looks symmetrical, but I don't really think it is. I have to kind of, turn my die until I find that it locks in and it looks like, all right, there we go. You'll know when you see it, when it goes in the right position. Okay, so we've got that. We need our raindrops. I'm gonna get the large raindrops. You have large and small in this set. And then my little cloud right here. 
This is my favorite cloud in the set. The clouds do have stitching along the edges, which makes me happy. Any images with stitching on them make me very happy. All right, now let's get all of this off of here and get our sun and the raindrops. Here's a little pro tip for you. Grab your, um, your take your pick tool and it will make it so much easier to pick them up and to poke them out. Okay, so we've got that. Um, if your die is stuck, it has little holes in there as well so that you can get it out. Okay, so now let's bring all of this over. I'm going to take dimensionals again and put this on here with dimensionals. I believe this piece measures one and a fourth by four. I'm going to put that right there. All right, more dimensionals, of course. And I'm going to put the dimensionals towards the bottom of my cloud because we're going to tuck that sun in behind it so put it about halfway up like that and then let's see this looks like it may be a little bit crooked let's see there we go and then take your sun these nails you guys i swear they're more trouble than they are worth all right slide that sun behind there like that okay now Get your liquid glue, and I just use three um, of our little raindrops. Put three very small dots. A dot is a lot, don't use too much. And then arrange your raindrops like that. You're gonna need to give them a few minutes to dry. All right, last but not least, I have a we got to add a bow, of course. Pool party and, or no, um, pretty peacock and gold ribbon. It's very light and airy, this ribbon. It's not going to bulk up your card. It's a very, very lightweight ribbon. All right, so tie a bow and get it perfect. You can keep pulling those little ends so that it'll be exactly how you want it. Let's cut that off straight. And then grab a mini glue dot. And let's tuck that right behind there like that. And there you go, Sprinkled with Love, a very easy card that really um, makes really good use of that designer series paper as well as the stamps and the dies. All right, remember the paper is only available through the end of February, 2024. So make sure you gra grab it before it's gone and click the link here on YouTube, hop back to my blog and check out the other two projects and the free PDF. Have fun stamping. Thanks everybody. Bye-bye.